Da da da. Hello, good evening. Uh, my name is David. So we run the director of the movie. Uh, between the notes that features Ellen Grimaud, the wonderful French pianist Ellen Grimaud. So this movie features um, amazing people such as Yannick Nézé-Séguin, who is one of the greatest uh, conductor of all time, and who actually broke the barricades, really, of classical music to the masses with such intelligence and such modernity. He is in the movie. I have the opera singer Bryn Terfel, uh, but also conductor like Roderick Cox and a lot of really, really phenomenal uh, people, including Jacques Rouvier, who is the, the first teacher of Hélène Grimaud from the age of 12 until 18. And I'm extremely honored to have that movie premiere tonight. This is actually a world premiere at this iconic movie theater called Empire 25 AMC. So I want to thank from the bottom of my heart Ellen Grimo, who gave me that opportunity, but also all the team of Dutch Gramophone and the team of AMC, particularly Mr. Dom Presto. So thank you so much, Dom. Thank you, AMC. Thank you to the audience. And thank you to all the team uh, who works with me to make that movie happen. So I hope you're going to enjoy it. And I can't wait to show it to you. Bye-bye. What are your impressions about having the premiere of your movie tonight at the AMC Theater on Times Square? Oh my gosh, well, first of all, I think it's more your movie than mine. Uh, it's a privilege for sure. I'm aware of, uh, of the fact that it is an honor. Um, the good thing is, as always with you, I don't know what to expect, which is fantastic. It's an adventure, so I'm looking forward. It's always something which fills me with gratitude, this idea that anybody might even be remotely interested, and then especially to get to work with someone who has this energy and passion um, as you do, it's, uh, and then every intervention of every colleague in the piece uh, is really, it's really humbling. Um, it's just motivation to keep going. Sometimes before you can keep going, you have to take a step back, and this is a good time to do so. What do you feel about classical music throughout the year? Yeah, but, but you're right. I mean, that's really significant because, you know, we often say classical music, but for me, it's not so much classical. It is the music of the time in which it resonates. And so it's very much the music of today. And it holds so much power, so much beauty, and so much truth. I think it's what everybody needs. So it has its place here. Ladies and gentlemen, good evening. How is everyone feeling? I'm sorry I don't hear you. How is everyone feeling? OK. Listen. This whole movie theater is about Beyonce, you know, but tonight you have the Beyonce of the piano. Ellen Grimo, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you. So let me introduce myself. I'm David Silvero. I'm the director and the producer of the movie that you're going to see tonight. Thank you so much. Thank you. I have two friends, one here, one here, as you can hear. <laughs> uh, I'm so excited to present you that movie, which is Actually, the first movie that was in partnership with Dutch Gramophone, you guys know Dutch Gramophone, give it up for them, thank you. And we couldn't have dreamed to have this first screening. I asked to my, my brother right here, Miguel, um, I finished the movie Sunday. <laughs> I did the last export Sunday. So, so this is really a brand new thing, but it's, it's a beautiful conversation uh, between this incredible genius, this incredible woman who has changed so much into her own field. I'm talking, of course, ladies and gentlemen, about the one and only who flew all the way from LA to be with us today, Ellen Grimo. So the, the movie is going to start, you know, it's about six hours, you know, <laughs> which in classical music is like a first movement, right? No, okay. You know, it is an hour, and after we'll be followed with a Q&A, you will be able to ask your questions uh, to directly Hélène Grimo. Ladies and gentlemen, I wish you uh, a wonderful screening. Thank you to AMC Theatre for hosting, because this is the first time that there is uh, a movie about a classical musician. So to have classical music in the midst of all of that, he means a lot. So thank you so much. Thank you for sitting here. Enjoy it. We love you. Thank you so much. Thank you.